So what's the easiest way to import data into the Integromat data store? I've got some data here in Google Sheets, and what we're going to do is we're going to take that, and I'm going to show you a quick and easy way to get that imported into a brand new data store on your Integromat account. So first of all, I'm going to copy, or I'm going to select, and I'm going to copy this data, and I'm going to go over to a website called CSV to JSON. I'm going to put the link in the description below so you can easily get to this. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to paste the data I copied out of my Google Sheets here, and I'm going to click Convert. And right over here, it converts our CSV to, a, to JSON code. So I'm going to select all of that and copy. And then I'm going to go over here to Integromat. And the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to put a JSON module here, a parse JSON module. And we're going to paste our JSON into this module. And uh, we're just going to manually paste it in there and hit OK. So that's going to save that data. We copied from our Google Sheet and turned it into JSON. We're going to put it in there. And if we hit Run, we're going to say Run anyway, you can see it's divided it into bundles. So we're going to take these 11 bundles, and we want to send that to the data store. So the next thing we're going to do is we're going to add a module here. We're going to search for data store. And we're going to add or replace a record. Now, uh, I need to add a data store, so I'm going to click Add. Now, I have to create a structure for my data store. I could add these fields one at a time, or I can hit Generator, and I can paste that JSON code in and hit Save. And it automatically creates those fields for me. Uh, I'd even notice the product price was a number. Created those fields for me, and they're done. And the names are going to match what I have in my JSON. So I'm going to hit Save. And I'm going to make my storage 1 meg for this example. You'd want to give it a name. And save. And now here are my fields. So I'm going to map from my JSON to my uh, data store module, the, the add replace record. And since these are all be new, it'll be adding them. So I'm simply going to map the items in here. All right, price right down there. Now, the key, you can leave the key blank when you import it into data store. If you do, Integromat will assign it a unique key. If you have a unique key that's a part of your data, which I do here, my product ID, I went and generated some uh, unique IDs, I'm going to put that in my key. So what that means is I can use that key to find the record in the data store uh, later on. So I've got all this mapped. I'm going to click OK. And now what's going to happen is I'm going to hit play on my, in my scenario. This JSON is going to be parsed, and the, uh, so there's going to be 11 bundles here. So there's going to be 11 records added to my data store. So I'm going to run that. And you can see right there is 11 records that have been added to my data store. You can see the record data. And that is how easy it is to add data from Google Sheets into your Integromat data store.